Hi, it's Mitch from PickDogs.com here with the free pick in the Oregon State versus Nebraska college basketball matchup on Saturday, November 18th, 2023. Of course, I give out tons of free picks every day, but when you give out that many picks, you're going to like some more than others. And to find out which games those are, you can go to our website, PickDogs, and click on the Premium Picks tab. Use the discount code PICK for 15% off. We also have the Dime Club and Sharp Trading Plays. These are meant for people who make big bets. Text the number on the screen if you make big bets because you can't get it at the website. you got to text the number. But let's get to this one. Oregon State taking on Nebraska. And, uh, you know, two teams certainly hoping to bounce back. And, you know, two teams in building mode. You know, a few years ago, Oregon State, they made that magical run in the NCAA tournament. Really one of the better runs that you'll see. They blew through the Pac-12 tournament landed in the NCAA tournament, and they were so close to going to the Final Four. But really, since then, they have been absolutely terrible. So what do you do when you have a coach like Tinkle who got you so close to the Final Four and has been terrible? Well, you continue to give him a chance. And I believe this year, he's got a team that has another chance. They look super athletic, at least at the top end of the roster. I don't know how much the bottom end of the roster is going to look like in the depth as the season goes on, but we'll have to see. Meanwhile, for Nebraska, it's Fred Hoiberg at the helm. And We've seen him do some pretty good things, you know, in the Big 12 Conference over at Iowa State. Of course, we also see him as saw him as head coach of the Chicago Bulls. Not such a great experience for Bulls fans or for those of us that watch the NBA having to watch that garbage. But at the same time, you know, the Huskers certainly appear to be at least possibly headed in the right direction. It's tough to tell with them because for them, it all really comes down to what they do in the Big Ten Conference. Last year, certainly a big step forward for them in the Big Ten, especially late in the season. Mid-February on, they were very good in the conference, but losing in the Big Ten tournament to Minnesota, a bad Minnesota team at that. So we'll have to see if they can advance a little bit further this time around. So far, they've had a super light schedule, so it's tough to tell. Beating Stony Brook last time out, um, beating Ryder, and beating Florida A&M, really not a big-time team or big-time program in the bunch, but they certainly have had their, you know, You take care of business against the teams that are in front of you. Meanwhile, for Oregon State, this is more, to me, of a more interesting story than what we see at Nebraska. Got the one-point win against Troy as a a seven-and-a-half-point favorite. I don't think they deserved to be a a seven-and-a-half-point favorite in that game to begin with, but they did get the win, and then a win over App State by 10 in a game they were favored just by two-and-a-half. So how in the heck are you, uh, you know, Two and a half over App State and seven and a half over Troy. Doesn't even make a lot of sense from from a from a high level. You know, Nebraska, just not very exciting on the offensive end. And Oregon State, they know if they're going to improve, it's got to be on the defensive end. But they do not defend the three very well. And Nebraska shoots the three very well. And that's where we get this point spread from. On the other side of it, though, Oregon State can shoot the three. Nebraska can play some defense as well. I think what we're going to get here, though, is value on Oregon State. And I, well, I, I, you know, I think this game could probably go either way, especially being a tournament game. I think we're getting way too many points to pass. I'm going to take Oregon State, and that's going to be my free pick. Of course, while you're doing your picks today, putting your bets in, be sure to use our free betting tools at sportschatplace.com. Our betting tools 100% free, and the way they work, they show you how often the bets on the board today actually hit. Then they show you today's odds, and that way you can assess the risk-reward, putting yourself on the bets that come in the most and pay the most. That's how you make money betting on sports.